वेलकम एवरी वन टू माई चैनल दैट इज़ फास्ट एंड ईजी मैथ्स विच इज़ डेडिकेटेड टू गिव यू टिप्स एंड ट्रिक्स रिलेटेड टू मैथमेटिक्स सो स्टूडेंट्स टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू सॉल्व अ डिफिकल्ट मैथ क्वेश्चन वेर वी नीड टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स ओके सो दिस इज बेसिकली एल्जिब्रा सो योर सी वॉट वी हैव इज एक्स रेज टू एक्स माइनस थ्री रेज टू टू एक्स प्लस वन सिक्सटी टू इज इक्वल्स टू जीरो वेन एवर यू कम अक्रॉस समथिंग लाइक दिस ऑल यू हैव टू डू इज यू स्टार्ट विद द फर्स्ट स्टेप which is very basic so here i know i can't simplify anything so i can take what two outside the for the indices of 3 how because both of these are even numbers so i will write the first number x raised to x as it is and this will be written as what 3 raised to 2 is common and i have x plus 81 is equals to 0 Now again, after this step also, I don't understand how to do this further. So I will simply do what I know. Three raised to two is nothing but what nine. Now please understand. Whenever you have a raised to m into n, you can write this as nothing but a raised to m the whole raised to n. Okay. So basically, here also I can write this as nothing but three square the whole raised to x plus eighty one. Is equals to zero. So now we have x raised to x minus three square is nine. The whole raised to x plus eighty one is equals to zero. Okay. So now what we can do is we can shift this on this side because other than that we have no idea what to do further. So we will do this is equals to nine raised to x plus eighty one. Okay. Now I can split this. Okay, see, understand. A raised to m plus n can be written as a raised to m into a raised to n. Correct. So here also I can write this as nothing but x raised to x is equals to nine raised to x plus nine raised to sorry into into eighty one. Okay. So now, after this, what we can do is let's divide both the sides by nine raised to x. You know, so why? Because then only one side of the equation will have variables. Okay, so here I will have nine raised to x is equals to nine raised to x plus sorry again mistake nine raised to eighty one upon nine raised to x. This and this will cancel. So now what we can have is see again a raised to m upon b raised to m can be written as a upon b the whole raised to m okay so here also i can write x upon 9 the whole raised to x is equals to 9 raised to 81 okay so now again we are stuck now i don't know how to do this further but what i can do is i can write this in terms of what dividing by 9 so if i want the numerator to be 9 and in my denominator also to be 9 so i can write see imagine if i have written 81 upon 9 i will get nothing but 9 correct so this 9 can be written as nothing but what 81 upon 9 i will just use this logic over here so i will have 81 upon 9 the whole raised to 81 and now comparing i can say therefore the value of my x is nothing but what 81 interesting right students if you like the way i have explained then please go ahead and hit the like button because that gives me tremendous amount of encouragement in doing these kind of videos and also students like always there is a diy I want you to tell me what is the value of x raised to x is equals to four raised to x plus sixteen. Do let me know your answers in the comment section. So that's it for today. I will see you in the next video.